Stephen. I just wanted to show you the website replay facility within the platform. So here we have the the replay option here where you can see the replays and here you can see we have some replays from this particular um, relatively new website. So here, first of all, you can see some of the visitor data. You can see the countries they came from, which will really help, again, to continually refine any marketing strategy that you're working to. So depending on where you're based, for example, if you're selling uh, e-commerce products and you have to ship them, and you only want to ship within your country and you see that most of the visitors are coming from another country, then of course that's something that you're going to have to rectify in terms of your traffic generation, um, your search engine marketing and your social media. That's bringing the traffic to your site. You can see how long um, they spent on the site here. And here you can actually see the replay. So let, let me ch choose quite a short one. Let me just, um, this one's three minutes and 33. So let's have a quick look at that one. So it tells you how many actual events um, were tracked and the replay duration and the actual time of the day. Um, so you can see they entered the main website here and um, let's take a quick look. Excuse my email. So you can see they're on the website there um, and they're, they've clicked to look at the, the main slogan and you can see that they clicked to look at the site overview and they're watching the video and of course um, you can see that what happens when they're watching the video there's no point in it, it, it speeds up to save you because you don't all you need to know is that they watch the video and as you can see they actually scrolled back Let's, let me go back here and then you can see they scrolled back down and then they left the site. So the, the point is that however your site is um, configured here, without having to play around with any detailed code, you can come in here and have a look at what's happening on your website. Um, and then the thing to do is to track this over time and to take this back and feed this back into your go-to market strategy. Thank you very much. I'm Stephen C. Campbell from analytics52.com and we'll see you soon in another video. Thank you.